So how would you guys like to actually pick your next legendary armor piece? A guaranteed way in getting a specific legendary. How does that sound? Well today guys, that is what I bring for you. How's it going people? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. So before we go any further, credit to a fellow content creator and legend in Laserbolt for the heads up on this method. His channel can be found linked below. Check him out for that awesome Outriders content. Okay, so this method allows you to basically pick your next legendary armor piece. If you need a specific armor piece, this works amazingly. Now I do want to clear something up as Laserbolt says within his video that this works for weapons too. I've had literally 20 friends including myself try this and all say the same thing, which we'll get to in a second. So how this works is pretty simple. So for the armor piece you need to complete all the monster hunts which you pick up or restart with Noah within the trench town. There are 10 of these in total which you need to complete and from here once you have completed them it's straightforward. So with these completed go back to Noah within trench town and cash in all 10 bounties or the remaining ones you have. But this is important so take note. Once you have cashed them in, do not reset the quest and do not back out of his inventory screen or his menu. Here you need to select what are you selling. Once in this menu, scroll across to that sell tab. When you are in this screen, you can actually see the guaranteed legendary rewards you got from cashing in these 10 hunt bounties. Now, if this isn't the one you want, all you gotta do now is simply quit out your game. This means on Xbox and PlayStation, you need to dashboard. On PCs, Alt and F4. Then it's as simple as loading back up and repeating the process. Heading to Noah Den Valley, cashing the 10 bounties, going to is what you're selling screen, scroll across to sell and check what the legendary is. And how this works is quite simple. Because you are still within his inventory screen, the game actually doesn't save until you leave it. So as long as you keep quitting out of his inventory screen, if the legendary isn't what you want, the next time you do this it will be a different piece. If you get unlucky and get the same item over and over, cash the bounties in within a different order. That might help. So again guys, complete the hunts, go to Noah, cash them in. Once done, do not leave his inventory. Go to his items for sales section, then scroll across to sell. Here you will see that reward. If it isn't one you want, hard quit the game and repeat the process of cashing in those bounties until you get that item. Now with the weapons, this doesn't seem to work as normal. If you have already done this before, complete the whole 10 wanted bounties quest line, you can't repeat it because what happens is, as you can see with me doing this on screen now, on the very last bounty, if you haven't done these before, you get to actually pick your reward, a choice of three. This happens with every one you cash in for the first time. And this only happens the very first time you do this quest line. Anytime after this, you don't get the choice and it kicks you straight from his inventory. So if you haven't completed this already, you can literally go and do this and get any weapon of your choice by having a friend in here with you. As your loot rewards pop up on their screen, within that top right, if it isn't the one you want, if it isn't the legendary you want, they give you the call out and you hard quit out the game and repeat the process. But again, it only works the very first time you do this quest. Anytime after you repeat it, you don't get that choice of the three weapons, as as soon as you cash in that 10th bounty, it auto kicks you out of the menu and the game saves server side. But yeah guys, as far as I'm aware, this works for the armor only in the sense of being able to go back and repeat it. So enjoy that side of it while you can. I mean guys you can always create a new character and do it that way therefore with the UGO's uh, wanted bounties you are doing them for the first time. It is entirely up to you. And on that note the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.